Espanyol looking like relegation material on the other hand. Whatever one neighbour can do across town, Atletico Madrid could do just as well. At home to Valladolid and a 5-1 thrashing for the Colombian import. The uh, several Colombian players playing for Valladolid. Real's near neighbours, Atletico, really changing things around at home to Valladolid. First minute gift there and they're ahead from the penalty spot. Manolo, the uh, goal scorer. It stayed 1-0, in fact, throughout the rest of the first half, but with René Higuita involved, uh, sometimes you'd wonder how and why it did stay at 1-0. If I had the lead so much, the poor relations. Futre missing the sitter here. And no real problems, except when Vizcanio did manage to get himself booked as he tried unfairly to extricate the ball from the possession of the Atletico Madrid keeper. But uh, Luis Aragones, the uh, Atletico Madrid manager, had dropped Soler, the forward who hasn't been scoring goals particularly well, but who has been criticising the team in recent weeks. He was dropped and the changes that he introduced clearly did work the Oracle superbly. The goals really started to come in the second half. Higuita kept Ben Schuster at bay early in the second half, but it was only to be a temporary respite. Manolo getting his second just after half time from Schuster's corner. That's Manolo's sixth of the season in total. So even with Soler out of the side, there are plenty of goals and plenty of goal scoring options. And on 49 minutes, the game over as a contest. Manolo again getting through to finish after Donato and Tony had done all the build-up work. Poor defending by Caminera in particular. And the Atletico Madrid players clearly knew at this point that the game was over as a contest and they were taking maximum points to keep the pressure on their near neighbours and bitter rivals. Fonseca did manage to pull one back for Valladolid on 59 minutes. But there was really no stopping Bernd Schuster. Atletico just getting a little caught going forward and Fonseca there 59 minutes pulling one back for Valladolid. But it's a lonely job being a forward in a team which is conceding goals at a rate of knots and also creating or conceding territorial advantage as willingly as this team did. And Schuster at the heart of most of the good things that the Atletico forwards were putting together. Here he is. Magnificent finish on 67 minutes to make it 4-1. And a player who seems to worry not a bit about the passing years. 89 minutes, the icing on the cake simply. Very, very much one-way traffic, but into the last couple of minutes. Higuita still having to work overtime. Chances galore, as you can see, for Atletico. And it's Schuster again. At the end of normal time, as Valladolid slump back to be fourth bottom of the table, there is no joy at all for René Higuita and his fellow Colombians, Maturana, the manager, and Valderrama, imported as playmaker, but so often this season, the game seemed to be passing him by. And a very powerful exhibition from Atletico Madrid on home territory.